Oh, my name is Shane. I'm from TSC Travel Review. We're here today in Millville, New Jersey. We're doing a comparison review between suburban studio efficiencies and quality in suites, guys. Yeah. TSC stands for two sexy cowboys, guys. Yeah, man. Uh, it's myself and the other sexy cowboy, Mav, which we will meet later on in this review. Yeah. This comparison review is interesting because it's a review of two separate hotels which are housed underneath one roof. The only difference between the suburban studio rooms and they are efficiencies, they come with the following upgrades. They have a two burner electric stove, a small kitchenette, a sink, and wall mounted storage cabinets. They have a full size microwave and refrigerator. The kitchens are not stocked with the pots and pans, dishes, or silverware. You would have to bring your own cooking supplies. They did provide dish and hand soap, clean dish soaps, and a sponge. The suburban studios rooms are slightly larger and are laid out differently. Quality Inn has a desk, a rolling chair, and a closet with sliding mirror doors. The suburban rooms do not have these features. They both have the same style and size small kitchen table with two chairs. The other difference that we noticed was that the suburban studio's room had a swivel security lock while the quality in room had a chain style security lock. They both share the same office, breakfast area, laundromat, fitness area, and quality in room was on the first floor, which was nice, but the suburban studio's room was on the second floor. We're not sure if all the suburban suites are upstairs or not, and that was our experience though. Uh, the stair steps are under shelter from the weather, which was nice as well. And Shaman, how was your uh, experience? Yeah, I loved it here, man. The pool, that's got to be number one, man. Yeah. That's, that's one of the biggest reasons I love this stay here. Uh, the other one, man, I love the suburban room. Uh, it was nice and big, roomy. They were both roomy and spacious, don't get me wrong. But I just like the way that the suburban room was laid out a little better. The bathroom was laid out better. Uh, I found that the confined, the area where the toilet is is a little more confined. Uh, you know, you don't have enough room to put your feet next to the bathtub in, in the uh, quality one. Um, the breakfast was good. Uh, you know, they both share the same breakfast, the same uh, uh, buffet area and everything. They same the, share the same laundromat. They share the same uh, fitness room, the same office. It's like the same complex. Uh, since like the one room was upstairs and one was down, I don't know if the whole hotel is split like that or if they have like different rooms on different levels. I'm not sure. You would have to ask the office that one. But um, yeah, man, I, I had a great time. I was ready to move in to the <laughs> yeah. suite, man. It was like home. Very nice <laughs> here. Yeah. yeah, man. Yeah, uh, tell them about the uh, the personnel that worked here. Oh, they're great, man. Ellie, Ellie's not awesome, man. She's really helpful, uh, very knowledgeable. Judy, man, Judy's on top of everything. If you go in the pool and you, you don't have a wrist strap or she doesn't recognize you, you better run that way real quick, man. Yeah, get on your horse and ride away. Things, yeah. Yep. Got to hand it to Judy, man. She's, she's awesome. So, yeah, she keeps this place in order, man. Yeah, and then uh, for breakfast, we had uh, Lisa Quino. Yeah, Lisa. I'm not sure of her last name. I'm I think sure it's Lisa name, Quino, Lisa I'm pretty sure. Lisa, but, man, yeah, yeah she's top notch. Top notch yeah. Yeah, man, she kept that. Play spick and span. Yeah, uh, yeah the stock food was food. always stocked. Yeah, man, nothing ever ran out. She was right there, man. Very nice, Very yeah. Nice. She was yeah. right there as soon as you needed anything. She was right there if you had any questions. She, she kept everything nice and clean. The tables were all clean. Yeah, man, everything was nice and wiped down. The waffle makers were all clean, and the whole area was just kept up. So. Yeah, it was very nice. Anything else you need to say? Comparison between the two, um, I would say the only difference is like if you need more room, if you want to be staying longer, I would suggest the, the efficiency uh, if you want to do your own cooking or anything like that. Uh, the big fridge was really great to have. We loved that. Uh, we yeah. had the big sodas. We had our big bubble. Yeah, <laughs> made it. We had everything, and we had our like little celebration. We had the big bubble. Uh, other than that, guys, as far as uh, comparison, 
I believe that the, both showers were pretty comparable. Um, water pressure and everything was, it was great. Uh, the water temperature was great in both. They both had the security grab bars so you don't slip or fall. And uh, the non-skid uh, surface on the bottom. So that was nice. Alrighty then. Uh, which one did you like the best? Definitely the suburban. Yeah. yeah man. I was already moving then. Yeah, more roomy and uh, more roomy, more comfortable. Everything was laid out better. The only one difference that I did like was the desk and rolling chair. Yeah. The kitchen tables were the same, pretty much the same size. They were nice and efficient. So had nice chairs, two nice chairs. Yeah. So yes, uh, I would definitely choose and uh, recommend this, the uh, suburban. You know, especially if you're staying for a little longer or yeah. Already then. I hope that you uh, enjoyed watching my review, guys, and my comparison. Let me introduce you to the other sexy Captain Man. Hey guys, this is Matt, and we're here in Millville, New Jersey, and we're going to do a comparison on two hotels here. One is the uh, Suburban Studios, and the other one is the Quality Inn and Suites. And they're both in the same complex, guys, so it's an unusual type of situation here. The Suburban Studios has an efficiency. It has a big full-size refrigerator, full-size microwave, has a countertop with cabinets and everything with a sink and a cooktop. And it's very, very nice, guys. Uh, the bathroom is just a slightly little bit bigger and uh, the room seems to be more bigger as well. All the other amenities in the room are just basically the same except for the closet area which is a little smaller because you take up the counter space. But all in all that's a great room. If you're going to be staying for two or three days it's, it's excellent. The uh, quality in the suites is very very nice. There are similar rooms. They're set up about the same. They have smaller refrigerator, smaller uh, microwave. And that one has a desk and a roll around chair. And the bathroom seems a little bit smaller, but everything else is about the same in there. As for the beddings and the, the showers and all that, they all have the uh, safety bars. And they both have kitchen tables with two chairs as well, guys. So you do have a nice place to set up and eat and do whatever you have to do around town here. It's very nice. And uh, you they all come with a uh, free breakfast in the morning. And the people that work here that make the experience stay here is extra special. Is you have Judy who works the counter. And she's very, very knowledgeable. She's fun. She's nice. Help you out with anything that you want. Uh, you have uh, Lisa Quenos. And she works in the uh, breakfast area. And she's very pleasant to be with too. She makes sure everything is uh, great with the uh, food and everything that you need for your stay there. Everything is good. She keeps us spotless, guys. It's very nice. And then also uh, at the main desk. And then you got uh, Ellie. And she was fantastic, guys. She's been here for quite a while and she makes your stay very, very pleasant. So, all in all, guys, this is a great place to stay. Really enjoyed myself here. The rooms are extra clean. They've been updated, upgraded, and they have a lot of great stuff going on. It's very nice. <laughs> and you know, by the way, guys, the uh, downstairs is handicap accessible. They have a lot of rooms that are uh, for the handicapped as well. Guys, and they. Uh, we're not pet friendly, but they do uh, take in your service dogs. Okay, Mav, yeah, man. In conclusion, we would like to know how you felt about your stay in both hotels, as well as what was your favorite between the two. I had a grand time here, guys. It was fantastic. Everybody was so nice here. Uh, the pool really takes it over the top. The two rooms were clean, they were nice. I do prefer the bigger room, 
with the uh, more amenities, so the, the bigger refrigerator and the microwave and uh, just the stove top. Everything was nice, so you could actually grab a meal, come back, heat it up nice, and here cook some extra stuff and put all your sodas and stuff because you take full size sodas in the big one. And all in all, I prefer the, the bigger suites. It was very, very comfortable, but the uh, smaller one was very, very clean, very nice, and I had no problems with that. That's a very nice economic room. They were both very clean. Yeah, they were both very clean. clean okay. okay, in conclusion, guys, I highly recommend this place. You can choose either the uh, economical standard room or you can have the efficiency room which is over the top which I like and they're all updated they're very nice and clean and the help here is makes your stay a lot better it's, it's very nice here so I highly recommend you come here and have a good time have a nice day what would you rate this hotel uh, one out of ten one out of ten uh, I would give it a nine straight across the board cool yeah both both places i mean they're they're really nice yeah, me too man I, I would say like nine to nine point five for uh yeah not nine for quality and nine point five for stu uh yeah, suburban studios right, yeah yeah man all right thanks guys once again we hope that you enjoyed our review and our comparison make sure you check out the full version of the video so you can see the full uh, reviews of both hotels as well as lots of other hotels and uh, all kind of travel videos restaurant videos all kind of uh, great things guys you never know where we'll be or what we'll be doing so keep an eye on the channel stay tuned don't forget to hit that like and subscribe guys and uh, you know of course leave the comments because all that helps the YouTube algorithm help other people and more people see our content now, much love, guys, and we'll see you in the next video.